Job, Job 32. So these three men ceased to answer at Eov, because he was righteous in his own eyes. Then was kindled the wrath of Elihu, the son of Barak El, the Buzi, of the kindred of Ram. Against Eov was his wrath kindled, because he justified himself rather than Elohim. Also, against his three friends was his wrath kindled, because they had found no answer, and yet had condemned Eth Eov. Now, Elihu had waited Eth till Eov had spoken, because they were elder than he. When Elihu saw that there was no answer in the mouth of these three men, then his wrath was kindled, and Elihu, the son of Barak El, the Buzi, answered and said, I am young, and ye are very old. Wherefore I was afraid, and dared not show you my opinion. I said, Days should speak, and multitude of years should teach wisdom. But there is a spirit in man, and the inspiration of El Shaddai gives them understanding. Great men are not always wise, neither do the aged understand judgment. Therefore I said, Hearken to me, I also will show my opinion. Behold, I waited for your words, I gave ear to your reasons, while ye searched out what to say. Yea, I attended unto you, and behold, there was none of you that convinced Eov, or that answered his words, lest you should say, We have found out wisdom. Eov thrusts him down, not man. Now, he has not directed his words against me. Neither will I answer him with your speeches. They were amazed. They answered no more. They left off speaking. When I had waited, for they spoke not, but stood still, and answered no more, I said, I will answer also my part. I also will show my opinion. For I am full of matter. The Ruach within me constrains me. Behold, my belly is as wine which has no vent. It is ready to burst like new wineskins. I will speak that I may be refreshed. I will open my lips and answer. Let me not, I pray you, accept any man's person, neither let me give flattering titles unto man. For I know not to give flattering titles. In so doing, my Maker would soon take me away.